Hey, dude, I ain't trying to eat no incense cones. As a kid, I've eaten plenty of sticks, so I don't think it'd be too too different from that. So. But I don't care what anyone thinks until the chat responds. I really would just want to hear what Nexic has to say about it. <laughs> no, I was asking if people would rather eat a tumbleweed or 20 incense cones. The tumbleweed's about the size of a basketball, but you only have to eat half of it. See, yeah, I'm going with like that, that yeah. That's what or I 20 or 20 small incense cones, about the size of like the tip of your finger. Uh, you just have to eat it, dude. Uh, I don't think you just have to eat it. You get a glass it's, of water. It's just, it's just like plant matter. Yeah, tumbleweed, yeah. Plant matter. Dude, I don't. Yeah, everyone's saying. Yeah, everyone's saying. Even I'm saying tumbleweed. If I'm being honest. Here, all right. we're we're gonna pull we're gonna pull some other we're gonna pull some other shit off my Twitter because I got some pretty good quizzes on there. Follow me. Okay, if you if you chewed it up, it's just uh, it, just think of like eating like a like a thin dead stick. You just like right. chew it up pretty well. Yeah, that's probably true. It probably would tear you up a little bit. It's like pumpkin seeds. All right, so see that one. It's, what's the best name? S thing, I'd say. I'm gonna name my kid that. Is there any actual like name for that? I don't know. Let's let's ask S the chat. All right, chat. We got another one. This is straight from Shadow Kaiba 420, aka Tequila underscore SSBM on Twitter, which is uh, as you guys know my Twitter that has nothing to do with melee, strictly to do with uh, quizzes. Oh, dude, you gotta tech out of that. Come on, boy. It's day one shit. He's doing the West balls on him. I actually did that to Q Baby last time we played. It's funny. Still doesn't learn. Um, all right. So what's the what's the best name, guys? Nate spelled N A T E. Nate spelled N and the number eight. Or that S thing we all drew in elementary school. <laughs> I didn't even see the, the actual name. Didn't get it. <laughs> and, and see, you're gonna have to sign this every check, every time you write your name on something. And so, would you rather be normal Nate, Nate with an eight, or the S thing we all drew? The S thing we all drew. Dude, everyone should pick the S thing. Is there an actual name for that, or is it just S thing? It's just S thing, dude. Drew. If you called anything else, you're a cop. Yeah, I agree. You're definitely <laughs> ops if you do that. Let's try ops. Oh! Nexic with the huge brain! That's Nate good, spelled Nate. like freight. Oh. Nate spelled like freight. Yeah! Nate with an N. Nexic This is why Nexic's brain and phallus are so large. It's because he do, he knows Max stuff like that. The thing is, Next quick, is uh, Flop says hello. Next quick. <laughs> if you if you spell it like that, people are gonna say it. Yeah, like like. Now that now that Nexic has put this in the chat, like I don't even care about anything else in life. So here I'm gonna give you guys a rundown directly in the chat. You guys can follow it here live with your boy. So like this, this is basically what we've come to the conclusion for the hierarchy Max with three of how X's. to spell Nate. Um, and thank you, Nexic, for being so enlightening on that. Ooh, cool up smash. Not really as cool as having you know the S thing as your name for okay. real, but it's an all right up smash, I guess. This is DJ and commentary hours. I think the best place to. Hide against Sheik is directly on the ledge when they're in a when they're in a percentage advantage. Oh, by the way, chat. Um, I'm pretty sure we got all the kinks out, but if Nightbot just banned you for no reason, uh, sorry, we still we had a few kinks in that system. So hopefully it's all fixed now. But like the last two times we had Nightbot, it banned somebody for no reason. So hopefully no one gets banned. All right, guys. Another good question that this has been weighing on my mind a lot lately. And, you know, like, I have a lot of trouble with insomnia and anxiety. And I think a lot of it stem stems from this uh, question. Who would win in a fight between Mewtwo or John Wick? Well, and John Wick Mewtwo has all his guns. the optimal being but also John Wick is the optimal like I mean John Wick did get his ass kicked in his house then his dog died so like Mewtwo probably wouldn't let that shit happen I'm saying but I don't know I think Mewtwo would fuck him up if I'm being honest 
But okay, so you're gonna say everyone's gonna say Mewtwo, right? Everyone's gonna say, oh, M Mewtwo can do the psychic shit and control his mind. What? Oh, that was almost sick. What if John Wick is wearing a tinfoil helmet? Yeah. yeah so he can't be a John Wick. He can't be affected by psychic. So Mewtwo can still teleport, and he can still shoot swift at him, and uh, you know he still has barrier and recovery, which are you know his moves. He can't use psychic because of John Wick's tinfoil helmet. But John Wick still.